This is Mr. Martin. Uh, in this video, we are continuing with uh, triangle sum and exterior angle uh, theorems. So uh, let's take a look at number 14 for this example. Um, and the first thing I always recommend that you do is to take a look in, in, uh, at the diagram and see what's going on. So we can see here, I've got uh, an exterior angle here for uh, angle DCB. And then I've got two non-adjacent interior angles or remote interior angles. And let's see, I want to find angle X, and then I want to find all four of these other angles. Okay, so I know that the exterior angle, that 18X minus 15, is equal to the sum of the non-adjacent or the remote interior angle. So if I add up those two angles on the inside of the triangle, so 13x minus 11 plus 4x plus 1, we know that they're going to be equal. The exterior angle is equal to the sum of the non-adjacent interior angles. All right, so let's go ahead and let's uh, combine some like terms on this side. So I have 18x minus 15 is equal to 17x minus 10. Let's subtract 17x from both sides. And I get x minus 15 is equal to negative 10. We'll add 15 to both sides. As always, if you need to pause the video to slow me down, or if you want to stop to ask a question, uh, go ahead and do that. All right, so x is equal to 5, so let's put that on our answer. And now we can go ahead and start substituting this in to find everything else. So C, A, B, C, A, B. That's going to be this angle here. So angle C, A, B. It's going to be 13 times 5 minus 11. We'll just go ahead and put that answer on the line. And that should be 54 degrees. All right, and then ABC, ABC, that's the angle at the bottom. So angle ABC, that's 4 times 5 plus 1. So that's 21. Now, I have that this angle is 54, and this angle is 21, so I know that this angle here, uh, angle ACB, it's the third angle of the triangle, so angle ACB, it's got to be 180 minus the other two angles, so minus 54 and minus 21. I'm just subtracting the other two angles from 180 because we know the three angles of the triangle add up to 180. And we should get that ACB is 105 degrees. All right, now that I have that ACB is 105, whoops, let's try that again. So 105. I know that these two angles are a linear pair. So this angle, DCB, on the outside, the 18x minus 15, it should be 75 degrees. So let's go ahead and check that. So angle DCB, 18 times 5 minus 15. And when we calculate that, we in fact do get 75 degrees. All right, so I ended up finding these in order. Uh, you're not always going to be able to do that. Uh, in this case, we could, but uh, keep in mind, you, you don't have to find your answers in the order that they give you the answer slots or answer spaces. All right, that's it for this video. If you have questions, make sure you get them answered, and we'll see you next time.